we will get some maintenance tomorrow but before we talk about that let's take a look at the daily rewards for the month of june so let's get this party started hello heroes and villains welcome to multiverse so the daily rewards for the month of June will be uh, for the gear, it will be the Apocalyptian Amazon style. So you have to log in for 21 days and you have to be a subscriber to get that reward. And also you will get the Sea Changed skin set. The Sea Changed skin set will be the rewards you get on day 21. Again, you have to be a subscriber and you have to log in for 21 days to get the skin set. It says that the skin set is inspired by Atlantis's uh, dolphin. Uh, I would have to look it up. It's probably the new 52 version, but I seem to recall uh, way back when in the olden days a dolphin had just uh, basically human skin, but I could be misremembering. And if you are a free-to-play player or a premium player, uh, you will get the style, the Fallen God style, with your daily rewards. And yes, sadly, it is the regular version of, of the Fallen God style. I sadly some of the enhanced version, especially the enhanced version that you do get from playing uh, Elite mode, they don't want to give those in the daily rewards. So usually when they give sets in the daily rewards, they sets that pretty much everyone can get already to begin with. So sadly, no elite set in the daily rewards. It's sad, but that's how it is. I already made a video about the Fallen God style, so I will put a link to that video in the description down below. So again guys, in order to be able to get the, the skin set and the Apocalypse in Amazon style, you will have to be a subscriber and you will have to log in for 21 days. Now let us take a look at the maintenance for tomorrow. So tomorrow, June 1st, 2023, there will be some pretty big maintenance for a server update for game update 135. So all worlds will be taken offline at 6 a.m. Pacific time on June 1st, 2023 to launch game update 135. And also it will also perform the name reclaim. So if you guys were waiting and waiting for the name reclaim, tomorrow will be the day of days for that. A downtime may last up to 12 hours. And sadly, it's going to be a pretty big one. Uh, there's the name reclaim, there's the summer seasonal, and probably something else I forget to mention. So here they do mention the summer seasonal, uh, the feat reorganization. Basically, they rearranged the UI so that uh, the feats would make a bit more sense. Uh, the artifact adjustments. Uh, there were some changes made to a few artifacts, like uh, the Eye of Gemini. So that's probably going to start uh, to be added tomorrow. Uh, there's going to be some gifts. I'm not sure what those gifts are supposed to be. I think it, it's to be able to make it up to people that did spend some time upgrading the Eye of Gemini. And now that they're going to nerf the Eye of Gemini, a lot of people are a bit uh, unhappy about that. So there seems to be some gifts about that. There's going to be also the Pride gift. Uh, yeah, Pride Month is starting tomorrow. So yeah, that was to be expected. Also, the new emotes should be added also tomorrow and more. So there's going, they're going to add a lot of stuff tomorrow. So that sort of explains the 12 hour downtime. Although with a bit of luck, maybe the downtime will not last the full 12 hours. Sometimes downtime uh, is a bit faster than they expect. But if you don't want to be disappointed, expect at least 12 hours of downtime tomorrow. If it's uh, less than 12 hours, even better. But expect 12 hours on the safe side. And uh, also again, they mentioned uh, the name reclaim. So again, those of you who are waiting and waiting for the name reclaim, tomorrow we will get the name reclaim. And we will also get the full update notes tomorrow. Usually they post the update notes after, at the end of the day, after the maintenance is over. Uh, if there's anything worth mentioning about uh, the notes, I'll tell you guys about it. Uh, but usually uh, it's not really worth it to make a video just about the notes. I guess we're gonna have to wait and see.